I am Jim Odessim, your host here for this little quick tech tutorial. And uh, you might have been referred here from uh, one of my earlier videos, or maybe not, but stay subscribed or subscribe for future tech tutorials. Anyhow, um, you might have wondered what type or what version of Intel HD graphics you have and I have uh, found out the easiest way to uh, find out and it's very simple fortunately so uh, without further ado let's dive into it press the Windows button or just the Windows icon in the bottom of your screen and then you write in settings or whatever it is in your language uh, it depends on what you use the system in for language I use it in Swedish so it's in Stellinger here and you see you want this logo so whatever language you use you should probably be uh, not so hard to find out then you get this nice little uh, board here and what you do is you need to click the first icon here system and then you can scroll down and at the do bottom of the screen here you see this little um, Egenskap for Bildschermskort. <laughs> well, it's basically uh, settings for your graphics card. You click that one, and here you have it. It says uh, what it is. You have an Intel, or I have an Intel R HD graphics 620. So, um, how does this help you? Well, if you want to download drivers, when you go to the drivers page, you basically just look for the one that says 620. Intel HD Graphics 680. Here you have the Intel Graphics page. Um, I give you a link to this in the description, which you can click on and at the same time support me, which is good. Uh, because then I can make videos about these things. Anyways, here you f you see this little intel.com and we have the different processors here. And what you want to do is you want to find what yours is. I already know uh, I already know what mine is and you have this uh, 620. You can see if you look at the other ones. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't tell you Sorry, you can just click the drop down menus here, but unfortunately, it doesn't tell you, um, you know, what generation it is, um, and it doesn't really make sense with the numbers. But there is only one of um, the version you're using or should be, uh, so then you can just see, uh, you see, this is UHD. So I guess this is the only one you need to be a bit careful if you have a UHD graphic instead of a graphic. But other than that, the numbers are uh, unique. Yeah. 620. So what I want to do naturally is I click this 621 here. I don't have a UHD, a normal HD. And then we scroll down here and we can find the drivers drivers and downloads and uh, you have two versions here and uh, this seems to be later so we'll click at this one it's a bit different versions so we'll click on this little view all here just so we can get to the more proper page and you can see we'll select drivers of course there were only drivers and now you can set your operating system if um, windows 10 is not the right option uh, we have two versions here generally you go for the latest release and if the latest release would and work for some weird reason you can try the earlier release which seems to be a, a stable one as well but you should probably not go f too far <laughs> don't download super uh, old drivers you see this is the latest the latest is usually the best just click on that and um, you wanna keep it simple so just just click the uh, download exe file oh yeah and just click 
Just click the download exe file here and save it to wherever convenient and then you can run the exe file and install um, the drivers. Also um, don't download it from any site. You need to download it from Intel's download center. Um, if you follow the link in the descriptions you won't get in the wrong place. Um, and that will prevent you from getting some malicious virus or software or uh, stuff some other people want you to install when you download them via their site. So always download from the official site like this one. And that's how it works. Um, so I hope this tutorial helps you find out <laughs> what your Intel HD graphics uh, are for uh, what, what you have for Intel HD graphics version and uh, yeah I will also make videos about how to find out what graphics card you have if you have a NVIDIA or AMD graphics card um, and find out what type you have of those and I will also make tutorials um, about what processor you have, how to find your processor version. So, thank you very much for watching. This is Jim Dism officially signing out.